the way around that right now with the other bridge closed. Thank you. Pools of water line the streets on Sanibel. Islanders are cleaning up the leftovers from Tropical Storm Devi. Places like Lighthouse Beach are having to replace sand that high winds blew away. Wink News reporter Tiffany Rizzo live on Sanibel this afternoon. Tiffany, how do people feel the city held up? Chris, the mayor says Sanibel held up pretty good. With any storm, you're going to have debris, power outages, some flooding. But overall, Sanibel's in good shape. Hurricane Debbie isn't stopping these Sanibel bike riders. But the paths have been fairly They're clear. clear. Yeah. They're not terrible, not, not at all. The Sanibel mayor, Richard Johnson, says that's because their crews have been working throughout the weekend to make sure their roadways are clear. Fortunately, the weather was not so bad that we had to call our crews back in. So they've been out clearing branches and some, some trees that fall, fell on the roadways um, d throughout the weekend. And so we're pretty much caught back up. But the beaches are going to need some work. They don't let you get in they yet on bikes. Go. Yeah. And, and the beach path by their house is full of water, so yeah, we couldn't walk water. there. The parking lots of the beaches are closed for now because there's sand where it shouldn't be and flooding. We just need some time for the water to recede and uh, either soak back into the ground or make its way back out to the Gulf. A lot of water. A lot of water, debris. But the mayor says the replenishment of sand after Hurricane Ian did its job and protected the island from any severe flooding. This weekend's tidal surge that we experienced at high tide, by the way, same time, they both occurred at the same time once again. I think we did very well there and we did not experience the type of flooding that we had earlier. So now these bike riders can continue enjoying the simple things in life. We like to get ice cream too. Yes. <laughs> ice, cream, yeah. ice cream and a bike ride. That sounds nice. Now, as you can see, the beach parking lot is closed for now. The mayor says that it's going to reopen in a couple days. And as you're going around the island, just be careful of standing water. Reporting live on Sanibel, Tiffany Rizzo, Wink News.